In crop production, quite often, the smallest detail has the greatest impact. Hello, my name is Jay Castleman with Nature's Alpine Solutions, and welcome to another one of our Nature's video blogs. Today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about our Rhizolink product lines. Now our Rhizolink product line is a culmination of our high quality NPNK, our Bio-K technology, and the Rhizobacteria. And the culmination of all these three features add a great deal to crop production. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Now when you hear me talk about our Rhizolink product line, being built with purpose, having the high quality NP and K, fortified by the Bio-K, and it possesses this rhizobacterium, this polymicrobial rhizobacterium. What that is, it's, it's a five strain bacteria uh, component that's put into this product. Each one of these strains uh, independently bring value to the table, but then also been chosen because their synergistic uh, abilities to also bring things to the crop uh, production. Each one of these cultures are independently stored, they're then cultured, and then they're mixed together, and they're put into an endospore state. This endospore state or form basically preserves the uh, rhizobacteria from any harsh environments, which would include uh, uh, right, uh, liquid fertilizer products. Now, if you look at a lot of our competitors, uh, their products cannot be added to liquid fertilizer, or if they do, they have a very short shelf life, they can't be stored in fertilizers, and we'll guarantee our viability in, of our bacteria in the storage of fertilizers up to 18 months. You won't find a competitor out there that will make those same claims. Another thing that this package brings to the table is that biodiversity I spoke about. You know, a lot of the competing products out there have a single uh, agent of effect. If there's a problem with that single agent, then you will not get the effect that you're looking for. Uh, having the benefit of having five different strains out there gives us a greater guarantee of achieving the results that we're looking for. Now, this um, biology, working within the rhizosphere, part of what links all of this is the root exudates. The root exudates is kind of like the catalyst between the plant root system and, and then the uh, uh, soil complex out there and the microorganisms. The microorganisms will reprocess a lot of these root exudates. Some they'll use for food, some they reprocess into secondary metabolites and take them back into the plant or they'll remain there in the rhizosphere itself. Some of those secondary metabolites could be such things as phytochemicals. Phytochemicals would be like the auxins and stuff like that that help us grow larger root systems to where we have greater root surface area, a more vigorous uh, migrating root system, exploring new areas, picking up more nutrient, more phosphorus, more potassium and such. Could be the production of enzymes like phosphatase or phytase. Phosphatase helps us dissolve complex phosphorus to where we can make it usable again. Lipopeptides help us create greater biofilm around the root system. This biofilm is basically the line of traffic. It's the, uh, the highway in which the rhizobacterium, nutrient, moisture, and that flows. Uh, siderophores. Siderophores will take our uh, uh, less soluble or insoluble iron components out there and make them soluble again. Lytic compounds and antioxidants, systemic triggers. Systemic triggers help us create greater plant health in uh, the crop so it can sustain uh, stresses and will tolerate uh, the impact of diseases and stuff uh, greater. Some of those phytochemicals that we were talking about, if you look at this next slide, look at the root masses. Remember, phosphorus, a lot of the other minerals like potassium, some of the micro elements in that, does not move to the root system. The root system has to move to those minerals. So the more exploring, the more vigorous, the larger surface area of a root system we have, the greater ability we have of taking up more uh, nutrient and more consistent nutrient supply. Look at the root system here. This root system here was uh, treated with the Rhizolink 31013 in furrow. The other side was not. Uh, you'll notice that the root mass where the Rhizolink 31013 had been used is two to three times greater. So that means two to three times greater ability to take up nutrient. And the evidence of that is very simple. Look at the stalk diameter. Look at the color. And then look at the distance between the growth nodes. There's no question that the stalk on the left side that had been treated with the Rhizolink 31013 received more nutrient through the season. 
And it doesn't make any difference whether it's a corn crop or whether it's a tomato crop or any other kind of spelt food crop. As an example here where we use the Rizoline 31013 just as a 2% solution on a drench on uh, starting plants. This tomato plant here is easy, it's, uh, exact, to be exact, is 233% greater by weight. Now that means a lot whenever it comes to transplant, plant vigor, and such things as that. Now, so what does it mean to crop production? It means the crop production that we can improve root surface area and overall plant health. I talked about that, doubling the root system, more migration, more surface area. We can improve nutrient uptake, uh, mineralization, and solubility of phosphorus and iron. We can assist in the breakdown of organic matter. That's another of the enzymes. The phytase helps us dissolve plant debris so we cycle our fixed nutrient uh, in a faster uh, fashion. This is important, particularly when we get into no-till situations. Uh, it supports the conversion of atmospheric nitrogen, improved nitrogen assimilation. This rhizobacteria can also pr promote the synergistic response that acts in a defensive manner against biological and environmental stress factors, as I spoke. Simply put, the nature's product line can impact plant emergence, plant vigor, fruiting, stress management, and overall plant health. Now this Rhizolink product line has a number of products in it. We've got a 31013, a 9153, a 0015, and the Rhizobacterium by itself. The number of products gives us a lot of flexibility in use and application. We can use these products in, in furrow starters. We can use it as a top dress material, as a foliar product, in drenches, and in fertigation. The feature of these products being the high quality MP and K, the high populated uh, pure culture polymicrobial all-star all -star team that's been put in the package, get a flexible use and application, and it's a product with proven results. I invite you to visit our website for more information. We can be found at the www.natures.com or you can contact your nearest Nature's representative or dealer. This is Jay Castleman. Thank you for watching.